Unlike the rest of the country, is in desperate need for veterinarians. Today was the white coat ceremony for some of the University of Arizona's College of Veterinary Medicine students. 13 News reporter Andreas Rendon was there. After years of hard work, students from the University of Arizona's College of Veterinary Medicine received their white coats today, marking the start of their clinical year. Hundreds gathered at the Tucson Convention Center's Music Hall to celebrate two hard years of studying and exams. The class of 2024 is only the second class to move on to their clinical year since the veterinary program's beginning. The class of almost 100 students say that friendships made during the last two years were once to cherish forever, and they're excited to see what the next year brings. It was definitely hard, but it's not supposed to be easy. Um, we work hard so that we can do a great job when we get out into the field, and I think that we all put in all the work, and we're ready to, to get out there and show everybody what we can do. During their time at U of A, the students worked with community organizations like the Humane Society of Southern Arizona, learning new techniques and helping to keep the feral cat population under control. We invited the U of A vet students to come and learn about trap neuter return and the importance of spaying outdoor cats for the community. Um, and then after that, they invited us to participate in their TNR week where they provided surgeries for TNR cats. The dean of the vet school, Julie Funk, expressed her pride and support for the students, leaving them with one last bit of wisdom as the students go on to their clinical year. They're ready. They've learned what they need to know. And so now open up their minds and their hearts and work with the veterinarians in their practices to really do the best for animals and their clients. And they're going to make some mistakes. And that's what in learning in the clinical year is all about. After today's ceremony, students will celebrate their commencement in one year and head out to be veterinarians after that. And of course, we wish them the best of luck. Reporting from Broadway in Church, Andres Rendon, 13 News. Certainly wish all of those.